my gosh. I think tomorrow or the next week, I'll be finished with the first season, which is really, really cool. And um, well, I'll be back with the second season, which I think is also 11 episodes. And if I'm not mistaken, there may be a season three coming out soon too. So that's gonna be fun. I don't know how my hair, my hair is, is poofy and big and I need to accept it. I need, I, I have to accept it. Oh my God, I have to accept my hair. When will I accept my hair? Do you know what I mean? I love it, I'm loving it now. But I had a really hard time with my hair, being very curly and uh, I think a lot of curly girls have that in their head. <laughs> we are not very confident about our hair. And I can't speak for everybody. There's some people who, who know what they have and um, uh, it's been a process for me, but I would just get like, I'm like, oh no, my hair is, looks like this and it's tangled and it's frizzy, but it's, I'm lucky to have hair and I'm lucky that it's healthy and I do love it and uh, I have to be more kind to myself and and also get you know it's just like I'm so thankful that we live in a time where we get to see so many different people like with different looks because I think what was a big issue for me was in media like all I would see was like straight hair and uh, you know blonde hair and um, and so I was just like, well, I don't look like that. That's the, the actors and actresses that I see or the models on magazines do not look like me at all. So I, it, it's, it, it creates complexes, I think, for people. But I'm, I'm just like, I've got to accept me. I do, and I do, that's the thing. I really, I love who I am. I'm loving myself more and more and more, but there's, don't, don't doubt that I don't feel insecure about myself, Some, like I'll look at myself and just be like, oh, come on now, <laughs> like it really, cause it's, it's just human, it sucks. What a waste of time too. What a waste of time and energy, just, this is what, this is what we, who we are, this is what we look like, let's accept it and like move forward and if people don't accept it, then they don't accept it, whatever, you know? Um, but here's to the my curly girls and curly guys, got, curly hair, frizzy hair, wavy hair. I'm your representative right now, I guess. <laughs> but um, here we are, a Konosuba eight. eight. Yes, nine, ten, yes. All right, I'm gonna jump in. I feel like uh, I'm on a good, my energy is in a good place. So that makes me happy. The other, I mean, look, the other day was not good. It's That's the thing about this. I wanna be real with you guys. Like I was, I was, <laughs> I was not doing well the the other day, but that's my life. Like I'm, I'll be like, today's beautiful. I feel beautiful. Life is beautiful. I want to smile at everyone. I want to see everybody. And then there's days where I'm like, I don't want to talk to anyone. I'm disgusting. I look horrible. I, I hate everybody. I hate myself. I'm done. I just, you know, and that's, that's life with like trauma. That's life with depression and, um, yeah, I guess that's just, I'm learning how to maneuver beforehand. I, I didn't have the tools or the understanding. I was just like in a constant state of, uh, distress, which <sighs> it's not a good place to be. It really isn't. And, um, yeah, I feel like I just, I gotta be more open because I think I see my, my struggle and I am, and I have a pretty, where I'm at now is a, I'm really lucky, right? Like I have, I have this job, I have my family, my boys, I have a, a partner who really truly cares about me despite my, like my craziness, you know? Um, and that is lucky. And so the cards that I was dealt like before all of this, like when I was a kid and all of those things, like it was not a lucky hand. It was a really difficult hand, but I'm lucky now that I like, it, just, it feels like sometimes you get chances, right? Like how many chances do you get? I know I'm not alone in that like 
where I will look at my early 20s and my teens and be like, whew, I could have died like many, many times. And a lot of it was like my own doing, like putting myself in dangerous positions and somehow I'm still here. And so I'm taking that, like I'm really lucky. And so the fact is I have to under, like I have to teach myself, train myself to like love on, on me and be grateful very grateful learn to be grateful just thank thank you god thank you universe thank you iman for still being here and still working and not giving up um so i think talking about this also allows people to see that life is not picture perfect and i because that's just unhealthy and i think that's a, the thing where the our culture is going like social media all that everyone just posts their beautiful pictures and their photoshopped you know pictures and filters and I I was doing that too and it's like it's, it's hypocrisy it's a weird it's it's a it's cognitive dissonance like we can't we're all struggling you know and some of us are struggling greater than others and uh, I think talking about this hopefully will allow other people to be like okay I'm not I'm not alone and you're not I'm here so if you feel like you're alone at least I'm here and that helps me to like to keep moving forward to be like okay if I could help at least one person genuinely that's all I want because I, I, I see how I suffer with my mental health and I I wouldn't wish that on anyone and uh, I know um, I know other people suffer even greater than I do so just like the, the amount that I'm going through and I'm like I want to be something of some support because not everyone has support so um, I'm here for you guys okay <laughs> that's that's that I'm gonna jump into this um, and oh thank you guys thank you for your support I'm filming all of these by the way without posting so it's like I, I like doing that because I don't know what's gonna how you guys will react or if maybe by this time you hate me I, I you've all you've got your pitchforks at this point you're like kill her cancel her i don't know i'm on episode eight and i don't know the reaction this is gonna get i i don't even know however i'm here um and i do want to say thank you to pa our patrons on patreon for supporting us and keeping us afloat and um really truly I mean the channel wouldn't be here without you guys so thank you so much and thank you to our subscribers and don't forget to like comment all that stuff gets the the juices flowing like at you know for come on like darkness darkness needs her her juices need to flow my juices need to flow the channel's juices need to flow and yeah we need we need the algorithm. The channel needs a revival. Please <laughs> support us. Uh oh. Oh no, girl. Ooh. I am a cold. Per I get cold so easily. <laughs> no. Maybe, oh right that too but also the fact that it's so cold and she just doesn't care she doesn't care <laughs> they're perfect for each other tr truly <laughs> they do but it's like you would have thought at, at this point they would have like gotten further and like saved some money, you know, like. I just the boobs, like I can't. <laughs> I love it. I just love. I love it. I love whenever she does. <laughs> oh my god. Do we know her? Don't know. Okay. Kumite. Futsu no ningen dewa naku. Richie. Oritachiwa sonoshigoto kawari ni hikyukete. 
彼女を見逃してあげることにしたんだが I'm like am I アンデッドのくせに店なんて構えてアンデッドのくせにあったかいお茶とか作っちゃったりしてすいませんすいません Did I miss an episode? Am I on the wrong? Have I been doing this the wrong way? 薄暗くてジメジメしたところが大好きな言ってみればナメクジの親戚みたいな連中なのひ,ひどい That's mean さっき女神の従者って私は悪そう悪質教団で崇められている女神悪アよ控えなさいリッチ割合にならない方がいいというのが世間の常識なので。That will never get old for me。ベルディアを知ってるみたいな口ぶりだな。待って待ってください。No, this man is literally bowling towards her. <laughs> so, I mean, freaking Megumin wasn't really wrong, huh? And Darkness was pretty right, too. ファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファイディングアウトファ
so creepy. <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> These owls. Well, you better pee in that bottle or the vase. Oh my god. I would just have to ask them what do they want. Or you pee on them. I... あの屋敷の近くに共同墓地があるじゃないですか。共同墓地って。ウィズと初めて会ったとこだな。巨大な結界を張ったようなんですよ。それで雪場をなくした霊があの。Oh, interesting. ちょっと失礼。<笑> Well, that was a good, that was fun. I'm just, I'm confused that I need to, oh yeah, it says season one, episode eight. Why? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I, the, the whole whiz thing is weird because I, I'm like, did I miss something? But I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, I had fun. So, and I'm now I'm like tired, which happens usually after I do these like this back to back to back reactions and then I have like these conversations and then it takes a lot of energy out of me to talk a lot. But I um, will be back next week. I will be finishing this season and then jumping into the next season and we're we're going to still be doing the um um I guess the the double episode drops to to YouTube, which is like, uh, for example, the two and three episodes are together, four and five, six and seven, um, and so so on and so forth. So that will be so you kind of get more of like the cut down version of like the best bits on YouTube, but you can go to our Patreon and um, you'll still be able to get like the full cut down version for like all the episodes so one two three four five all the way up to 11 um it's just on youtube the the episodes that are can they'll be condensed to kind of like the better parts the more exciting parts of the reaction um but if you want and then also the the full timer reactions are on our patreon as well um okay that's it i i hope you guys enjoyed watching with me i will see you guys next week bye everyone <laughs>